So, uh, I'm making this recording because I really wanted to talk, and uh, I don't really have anyone to talk to except for my, uh, my camera here. Um, I wanted to talk because I just had kind of a fucking weird and intense fucking experience, uh, a really big adrenaline dump. You know, if you know about the, uh, the autonomic nervous system and the fucking fight or flight reflexes, all that, that sort of thing, I have very, very finely tuned fight or flight reflexes where uh, I can really get good adrenaline dumps and really make good use of them too. Um, I was uh, walking through the woods by the bus station, uh, just randomly wandering, and out of the corner of my eye, and this is without a light on in the middle of the night, I don't know how I saw this guy, it's a fucking miracle I saw this guy, I saw what I initially thought was a fucking M65 three-color woodland fucking jacket just chilling there in the woods, I'm like, oh, that's sweet, those things are nice, I'm gonna go, I want to grab it, pick it up and look at it, and there was a guy in it, and uh, he was not responsive, he was cool to the touch, he was blue, he was actually like uh, darker colored skin, Hispanic or something perhaps, I'm not sure, um, but, like, still obviously blue on top of that, and cool to the touch, not responsive, and, uh, I was like, oh, holy shit, that surprised me at that second, I'm like, oh my god, this dude is almost certainly overdosing, um, because that's the most common reason, I think, for people randomly passing out and dying in different weird spots around where I live, is the number one reason that for this heroin ODs. Um, so I knew there was a, a timer ticking, I didn't have any Narcan with me, which I do have at home, but I don't usually carry it when I go out, I should in this town, I guess. Um, but, uh, oh, man, this dude was fucking gnarly. I got 911 on, on the horn, of course, phone on speaker, all that jazz. And uh, I was talking and uh, giving 911 all the information I could. Uh, I'd pass along some extra information, too, like I told them to tell the responding units that I would be signaling with whistle blasts in intervals of three to let them know where I was, because I was way back in the fucking back of the, uh, the bus stop. And uh, my phone actually has a, uh, a strobe mode on it that uh, spells out SOS, you know, dot dot dot, dee, 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 dot right? um, so I was able to get the EMTs there fucking right away and man I really didn't want to give this guy mouth to mouth I definitely did not have a CPR face shield the thing about fucking intravenous drug users who shoot up drugs is they commonly share needles which means they commonly share diseases and so I really didn't want to go putting my mouth into this guy's and start trading body fluids with, the, with this you know fucking stranger he wasn't that cute you know um, yeah so I give him the whole sternum rub, which is basically where you take your knuckles here and you rub it into someone's chest as hard as you fucking can. You basically do your fucking real good with the uh, with the knuckles here. And uh, the idea is to hurt them so badly that you'll get a response from them and maybe uh, uh, wake them up or possibly even fucking I, I restarted this guy's heart. Either that or me pressing down on his chest might have compressed his, his heart again. But they could all stir him up and it was just like a shot deer when you do it to people because it fucking hurts so bad it wakes them up with an adrenaline dump usually. And this guy just got right up and tried to run away. If you've ever been hunting and shot a deer, oftentimes they'll fall and then immediately get back up and try and sprint away. But well, the same thing with humans. It's a very basic survival um, a response that people do unconsciously and uh, the whole lizard brain thing. But whew, yeah. Man, I am such a fucking adrenaline junkie. I love it. I love it. Um, oh, man. I've done a lot of drugs, but trust me, adrenaline is the best, and you make it yourself.